Open Deep Sea Configuration Suite. Power up the controller. Connect the cable to your laptop and to the back of the controller. The configuration suite will display when connected. Click on Tools. After dropdown, click on Update Firmware. Firmware Update Wizard will appear. Follow the instructions. The device type for communications will be USB Unit Default. Click Next. Unplug the USB cable and power down the controller. Click Next. Click the Browse button to search for a correct firmware version. In this example, the proper version is 45XX MK11. Click Choose. Choose the proper version from the list. Confirm with program being installed. Choose the proper model with the unit being updated. Your choice will auto-populate. Click Next. Connect the USB cable and turn power on. Downloading will start automatically. you will receive the Update Complete notification. When the firmware update is complete, the next step is to install the operating program. Open the file. Go to the Destination folder. Choose the proper program for controller module, firmware, and generator model. When the program finishes opening, choose Write to Module. Ignore the warnings. If Notice of Update Engine File Available message appears, ignore that warning as well. Confirm Yes to write the configuration. When finished, press OK to close the window. To update date, time, and engine hours, open SCADA. Once open, scroll to the bottom and open Maintenance. The Maintenance window opens where you can update date, time, and engine hours. Click Open Hours. Enter desired hours and press Set. Write to Module. 